sorry, the number you have dialed is not in service at this time. All right, Fuzz Pie Guy here. I'm going to show you how to update your your block list for a uh, pie hole. Now, I see a lot of people online asking how to do it, where to get the uh, URLs and whatnot and all that. So, I'm already logged into my pie hole interface here. And as you can see, it's running. Now, you don't see a temperature or nothing over here because I'm running this on a uh, atomic pie. So... Anyway, if you come to my website, and if we go over here to Pie Hole, click on Block List, I have a bunch of block lists here already, if anybody needs them. Now, there's others out there, plenty, and uh, a lot of these will work. Some you might have issues with, like I was running one the other week. It really blocked a lot of sites, so I just had to turn it off. So anyway... We're just going to go ahead and grab one here. We'll copy it. So once you're logged into your pie hole, we're going to go to group management, add list. And we're just going to paste our URL here. We can add a description, which we can do something like if we just want to test it, we could just say test, click add and it added it and now it's down here but if we go back to our dashboard it didn't update anything because we need to update the list so if we go to tools and click on update here we are going to update our list now now you want to stay on this page until it comes back and says it's done so We'll just sit here and wait a second. All right, so there we go. So now if we go back to dashboard here, as you can see, it may move it, it may not. It all depends on what uh, list we are uh, trying out. So let's try it again. Add list. And we'll just say test one add then we can go to tools update update all right so that updated so let's see if it changed anything and yes it did so there you go so that's how you can add a block list to your pie hole setup now if you do have issues with the add list you can turn them off by just clicking on this and there we go then we can re-click and now it's back on so that's pretty much it i thought i would just share this and hopefully it kind of helps people out and uh thanks for watching stay tuned for another one